troy weight is a system of units of mass customarily used for precious metals and gemstones. There are 12 troy ounces per troy pound, rather than the 16 ounces per pound found in the more common avidopois system. The troy ounce is 480 grains, compared with the avidopois ounce, which is 437 and a half grains. Both systems use the same grain defined by the International Yard and Pound Agreement of 1959 as exactly 0.064798.91 gram. Although troy ounces are still used to weigh gold, silver, and gemstones, troy weight is no longer used in most other applications. Etymology Troy weight probably takes its name from the French market town of Troyes in France where English merchants traded at least as early as the early 9th century. The name Troy is first attested in 1390, describing the weight of a platter, in an account of the travels in Europe of the Earl of Derby. Charles Moore Watson proposes an alternative etymology. The Assize of Weights and Measures, one of the statutes of uncertain date from the reign of either Henry III or Edward I, thus before 1307, specifies tron upon duration m, which the public record commissioners translate as troy weight. The word trona refers to markets. Watson finds the dialect word troy, meaning a balance in rights dialect dictionary. Troy weight referred to the tower system. The earliest reference to the modern troy weights is in 1414. History Before the adoption of the metric system, many systems of troy weights were in use in various parts of Europe, among them Holland troy, Paris troy, etc. Their values varied from one another by up to several percentage points. Troy weights were first used in England in the 15th century, and were made official for gold and silver in 1527. The British imperial system of weights and measures was established in 1824, prior to which the Troy weight system was a subset of pre-imperial English units. The only troy weight in widespread use today is the British imperial troy ounce and its American counterpart. Both are currently based on a grain of 0.0647989 gram, with 480 grains to a troy ounce. The British Empire abolished the 12-ounce troy pound in the 19th century, though it has been retained in the American system. Origin The origin of the troy weight system is unknown. English troy weights were apparently derived from the nearly identical troy weight system of Bremen. An alternate suggestion is that the weights come from the Muslim domains by way of the gold dirim, in the manner that King Offa's weights were derived from the silver dirim. According to Watson, Troy is not linked to the town in France, but a dialect word Troy. Then Troy weight is a style of weighing, like council or bismar weights, or other kindred methods. The troy weight then refers to weighing as if of small precious or potent goods, such as bullion and medicines. Units of measurement. Troy pound The troy pound is 5,760 grains, while an avid of poise pound is approximately 21.53% heavier at 7,000 grains. Troy ounce 1 troy ounce is equal to 31.103476.8 grams also equal to 1.097-142.86 avidipoise ounces, exactly squared, or about 10% larger. Pennyweight The pennyweight symbol is DWT. There are 24 grains in 1 DWT, and 20 DWT in 1 troy ounce. Because there were 12 troy ounces in the old troy pound, there would have been 240 penny weights to the pound. The basis of the fact that the old British pound contained 240 pence. The D in DWT stands for denarius, the ancient Roman coin, referred to in the New Testament, that equates loosely to a penny. The symbol D for penny can be recognized in the old style notation for British pennies, in which a quantity of money expressed in pounds, shillings, and pence was indicated using the symbols pound, s, and d, respectively. For example, 6 pounds and 11 pence s, 8 d indicated 6 pounds, 11 shillings, and 8 pence.
Troy grain mint weights mint weights, also known as money as weights were legalized by Act of Parliament dated 17 July 1649 entitled An Act Touching the Monies and Coins of England. A grain is 20 mites, a mite is 24 droits, a droit is 20 perits, a perit is 24 blanks. Scottish system. In Scotland, the incorporation of goldsmiths of the city of Edinburgh used a system in multiples of 16. Thus, there were 16 drops to the troy ounce, 16 ounces to the troy pound, and 16 pounds to the troy stone. The Scots had several other ways of measuring precious metals and gems, but this was the common usage for gold and silver. The pound was 7,716 by grains, but after the union, rounded to 7,680 by grains. This divides to 16 ounces, each of 16 drops, each of 30 grains. The rounding makes the ounce and grain equal to the English standard. Dutch system. The Dutch troy system is based on a mark of 8 ounces, the ounce of 20 angles, the angle of 32 as. The mark was rated as 37.98 grains, English troy, or 246.084 metric grams. The divisions are identical to the tower system. Conversions The troy system was used in the apothecaries system, but with different further subdivisions. Relationship to British coinage King offers currency reform replaced the siat with the silver penny. This coin was derived from half of a silver dirim. The weights were then derived by a count of coins, by a mix of Charlemagne and Roman systems. A shilling was set to 12 pence, an ounce to 20 pence, and a pound to 12 ounces or 20 shillings. The penny was quite a lot of money, so weight by coins was not a general practice. Later kings debased the coin, both in weight and fineness. The original pound divided was the tower pound of 5,400 grains, but a later pound of 5,760 grains displaced it where once 240 pence made a tower pound. By the time of the United Kingdom Weights and Measures Act of 1824, a troy pound gives 792 silver pence, still minted as such as Maundy money. Sterling originally referred to the Norman silver penny of the late 11th century. The coin was minted to a fineness of 11 ounces, 2 DWT, or 925 millesimal fineness.